How's it going everybody on YouTube? I'm back at it again with a part 8. Now in the last video, Lily was freaking out about the medicine and all of the painkillers being stolen and she was talking to Lee and I had to go figure out where everything is and just basically be a detective and all of that. And Duck ended up helping me and being like a sidekick and our base it ended up getting raided by bandits and we had to flee in the rv so if you guys have not seen that video i will link it at the top right corner i'll put it at the bottom of the description so you guys can watch it i hope you guys give this video a big thumbs up and enjoy the video and watch to the very end so hope you guys do enjoy it let's get straight into this okay i'm fine i'm fine oh shit oh shit oh shit i'm sorry calm down we need to figure out why this happened. Nobody died. We're okay, right? Katya, you're okay? We just lost everything. But we have our health. Cat's head is split open. I'm fine. Somebody in here caused this. Settle down back there. The bandits have had our number for weeks. This is different. Somebody was working with them. Whoever it was was slipping them our meds. They didn't get their last package, so they attacked. Calm down back there. That's nuts. Lee found a bag of supplies hidden outside the wall. It's true. So, Ben, I think we need to talk. Whoa, what? Lily, let's think about this logically, no? Logically? The new guy who could have easily been a plant? I think that's pretty logical, Doug. You think I'd do anything to hurt you guys? Don't play dumb. Were you hoping they'd eventually kill us all and you could join them? Why Ben? What makes you think it was him? He's always so eager to see what supplies we found. He came into this crew as stranger from the woods. It's pretty cut and dry to me. I came into this crew as a stranger. So you're saying you did it? Nobody did anything! I know I don't get wrapped up in the politics around here, but we really need to think before we start stringing somebody up. Doug, that is true. I appreciate your concern, but we have all the evidence we need. Doug's right. Let's just get on down the road. We can talk this out like adults. Why give someone who almost killed us the opportunity? Lee, you know what we found. Just let me out of the car. I'll go. I didn't do it, but I'll go. Good. That sounds great. Lily, look at him. I... Fuck. Jesus, I didn't. Look me in the eyes and tell me you didn't have anything to do with it. I... Oh my goodness, Shit, what the heck? There? Did he not see something. that? We gotta stop. Oh, Did he fuck? not see that we zombie? We can deal with this now, then. The zombie was just standing there. Is it safe? Should be. Everybody out. Lily. Out. Kenny, the RV has some surface damage, but there's a walker trapped underneath. God damn it. Everyone keep your eyes peeled. You know what? We shouldn't just kick you out. We should hear what everybody thinks. I think you should chill out. Please, look, it wasn't me. Please stop accusing me. I'm really sorry you're upset, Ben. Just tell us you did it. No! Ah, this dumb fuck walker! You okay over there? No way it was Ben. It was somebody else. Could have even been someone sneaking into our camp. That's ridiculous. That's what you think? Yes. Okay, fine then. Kenny? I don't know. Fuck. Just stop, would you? Well, your vote counts for you and Katja. We don't need all these votes. What do I have to do for you to trust me? I'll do anything. I'll, I'll do watches for months. Stop panicking. Seriously, Ben. You need to stop and just take a breath. Do we need any more evidence than this? Evidence or not, this isn't any way to treat one of us. I've heard enough out of we you, We should okay, honestly Doug? stop arguing. Kenny, what's it gonna be? Just give me a damn minute. Ben, you have until Kenny kills that Lily walker is to tell me it was the you. Heck out. No! Ben! Lily! This is about trust, and I've never trusted you. Lily, lay off. I can't leave. You know I Please can't. Please stop. Please don't kick me out of the group. We won't. Tell me. Now. Please, let's just get back in That's the RV. That's not happening. I can't handle this. 
There! I got him! Now, what the fuck's the problem? Ben! No! Oh my gosh. No! No! Oh my gosh. Penny, what's happening? You duck away from the windows. Jesus Christ. Get in. We're leaving this crazy bitch. I didn't mean to. It wasn't supposed to be him. Just get in. We'll figure out what to do with you. It's a bad idea, Lee. She's a murderer for shit's sake. I'm a murderer? You've had Lee with you this whole time. What are you talking about? He didn't tell you? He killed someone before all of this. He was a convicted murderer. Is that true, Lee? Yes. Fucking hell. Were you ever gonna get around to telling me that? You got a little girl with you. To hell with it. I don't have anything I don't wanna hear left. it from either of you. Just get in. Doug was useless. I kind of liked him. I kind of like just wanted him in the group. Lee, a word, please. All right, let's go talk to Penny's wife. What's up? Is Duck feeling all right? What the fuck? Happened during the raid. Stop the RV now. What if he turns? I don't see any signs of that. He is tired. His breathing is fine. We don't think they just turn. That guy we dragged out of the woods had to full-on die. He might be fine. Guys... What else is there to do? We thought you should know. Not that you've ever afforded us that type of luxury. Anyway, if you could tell Clementine, we would appreciate it. I didn't even mean to, like, say stop the RV like that. I thought I was just gonna, like, you know, stop the RV just to check on him, but I, I said it so rudely, damn. Duck is bitten. Everybody hates each other. This he is got crazy. Hit by a walker trying to escape the motel. I don't feel good. What about Doug? There was no time for a burial. Walkers? Yeah. Horrible. you outside my treehouse that day and thought about dropping a hammer on your head. What? Why? In case you were up to no good. Before you, there was this other guy. He was yelling and trying to get into my house. He wanted to take the TV and tried to break the glass door with a rock. Then some walkers came and scared him away. The door was open. He was dumb. <sighs> what the 
hell? What the hell? No. Oh my gosh. No way. No. No. What the hell? Oh my gosh. That scared the hell out of me. What the hell? It's a train. Is there any way to get around it? Doesn't look like it. On foot, maybe. Can't really afford to do that now. This seems like a safe area. Well, this brush will stop anything from creeping up on us. And I'd like everyone out of the RV except her. I don't want folks trapped in there with her. Why don't you and I go look around? Yeah, everyone else relax. Clint, stay close to Kenny and Cat, okay? Lee, if you come across anything to drink, uh, if there's a dining car or something, I think Duck's a bit dehydrated. It's a freighter, hon. Be careful in there. What? You think there might be something dangerous inside an abandoned locomotive? That would cross my mind. Okay, like I said in other videos, guys, I might replay this game because I'm just making like really, really, really out of pocket choices. And um, I just n really never played the game before. Like I said, this is my first playthrough of the game. So like, I mean, the, the whole group hates each other and they don't uh, see me as a leader. So um, we're just gonna check this train out. hope so, but this looks recently used. Be on the lookout and have your guard up. Okay. So we gotta be careful because someone could live here. I'll take this to catch him for Doc. A map of where the train goes. I think these tracks might lead to the coast. 27, Savannah. That's where Kenny's got us headed. Ooh, we might take the train. Let's go see if the conductor is still around. Prime engine. Nothing. Okay, there is something I have to do to get that turned on. But let's still look around real quick. Let's keep looking around. Okay, why is... Okay, for a second, my character was frozen for a sec. What the heck is the point of even opening that? What am I looking at? Okay. What the heck are, is even the point of opening those doors? Shit. We got one. Walker, sitting in the chair. We got him. Alright, he's dead, I think, right? Suppose we gotta look him over. 
Yeah. Oh, he was already shot. I don't think this guy came back. Christ. That light is blinking. Push it. Push it? Why not? Are you fucking serious? Here, look. It's just the brakes. Okay, I'll give you that one. This fucker works? Seems like it. I'll be damned. How the hell do we get it moving? I don't know. That's Mr. Amtrak over here. No clue. We found just this push in the buttons. Box back there. Whoa, is this what it looks like? That's how you get it I to work. So. This horse will take us right to Savannah. A hundred tons of steel. Put a thousand walkers between us and the ocean, and we don't have to give a shit. I can't believe it. What about Doc? What about him? We can't act like nothing happened to him. We can't act like he's dead, either. Okay. Fair enough. Try to get this thing started. There's gotta be some sort of manual or something. Huh. <laughs> I don't know about that. That's the spirit. Ben, if you could keep an eye on the girls and duck, I'd appreciate it. I'm gonna make sense of these controls. Man, this could be exactly what we need. I have no idea what to do with these. Imagine if I just start pushing buttons and this train starts moving full speed ahead and we leave them behind. Shit, this is it. Instructions on starting the engine. Damn. Pages are gone. I can kind of see the indentations from the writing. Someone took the pages? Find a way to read the notepad. Okay, how am I supposed to find a way to read the notepad? A bunch of maps about Georgia's cities. Nothing about the train. What is this? Ugh. Okay. Oh, I can go out here. Nice. Oh, oh shit. shit! What the hell? Damn, that scared me. What the hell is that? Ammo no crackers? No way. I mean, I get that the animal crackers are s stuffed underneath his ass cheeks, but I want them. I thought those things were designed to save lives. I can't shoot him? This door's gonna hurt. Okay. to smash his head. All right, let's go get those animal crackers. Did, were they actually animal crackers? What the hell? That was like a guess. It's in pretty good shape for a wreck. Okay, let's figure out how to get that train running. I don't know why I got those crackers. Wait, can I come up here? Let's open this up real quick. Okay, I don't think I need anything from here. Let's open this up. Ooh, tools. Nice. What am I supposed to do with these? Okay, I'm just gonna take this one with me, 
since I can only bring one with me at a time. Alright, let's get down here. Let's see if I can use the tools on the train. No, I, I don't think I can use this tool on uh, the front of the train, so... There's gotta be a way for me to... I don't know. get out of the train let's go oh oh I can use the tool it's stuck I can definitely pry this thing free if oh I can bring it loose first I need the other tool okay I'm gonna go back and get an, a different tool okay we got the other tool now let's see if this works We need a bunch of force to break away all this rust and whatnot before I can pry anything free. Hold on, let's see if I can... Shit. Broken. Oh. There's gotta be a better way to do this. Let's go get the other tool. Let's try the other one. Okay, let's see if this tool works. We need a bunch of force to break away all this rust and whatnot before I can pry anything free. Oh my goodness, what the hell do I do? Okay, before I do anything else, I'm going to give Kacha some water. Really quick, should I give her the animal crackers or the water? Here, found some water. Oh, thank you. Perfect. He's allergic to bees. Is that right? That's all I can keep thinking about. Like, somehow that matters. It doesn't. I know. Well, I don't. But you're probably right. Okay. We found a notebook that we think might have had some starter directions on it. But the page is missing. Well, I'm sure you guys will figure it out. That was, um, helpful. That was very helpful. You know, even though Doug is feeling so bad right now, even, I said all of those mean things to him. I kind of feel bad for him, even though he was very annoying. Because at the end of the day, he's still just a kid. Okay, let's put this tool back because it obviously doesn't work. Let's use this one. Okay, this tool better work. Okay, it can work for me, please. What? It's stuck. We need a bunch of force to break away all oh this Oh my gosh. Okay, let's talk to Clementine. Maybe she knows something, I guess. I, I don't know. I, I doubt she knows anything. Hey, Clem. What are you going to do with Lily? There's nothing to do that would even begin to fit the crime. We could lock her away forever. I don't know about that one, huh? She killed him. Yeah, it, it's horrible. There's a notepad on the train. Do you have any pencils or anything in your pack? No. I wish. Maybe in the RV. What do you need it for? There used to be something written on the notepad that I need to know about. Bingo. Well, if you're not using it, I'd take it. I'm out of paper, and there's all sorts of new leaves around here. It's a good thing that she doesn't have that notepad or else we wouldn't get that train moving. She would draw all over it with those leaves. But anyways, what can I do to Lily? What, shoot her? What am I supposed to do? Leave her? That's just cruel.
Should I talk to her or no? No, I should let her think about what she did. Yeah, where the hell are the crowns or the pencils? Okay, that's getting out of the RV. Alright, let's see here. Is there any pencils or anything? Maybe where Lily was, uh, Clementine was sitting? Nope. Right here? Yes. Let's go. A pencil. I could have killed you. I had you while you were rummaging around in the front there. I know you did what you did for a reason, and part of me understands. But the other part sees you with your back turned to me and knows I could have killed you. I need to go. Out of the freaking RV like she had like super strength. We're fucked. Yeah, we are. Maybe, man. Maybe. Well, we're fucked if we don't figure out how this thing works. Can't spend the night out here. Duck is still sick, you know. We need to get to the city, the coast. We better figure out how to get out of here. I got a pencil, so that should help us figure out how to start up this train. You can read it now? Yeah. Should be able to just follow the steps to get the engine on. Sounds good. How the heck am I supposed to do this? Okay, so six. What the heck? Oh, okay. It's right here. Okay, let's read the notes. Looks like we gotta turn a couple switches down. Okay, two switches are already down. Let's read the notes again. Let's flip these switches on. Okay, let's see here. Let's flip this bad boy on. And this one on. Son of a bitch! Whatever you did, lit the dash up! So far, so good. Nice. Very nice. Okay. Um... Let's do three now. Oh my gosh. I'm clicking on the wrong things. All right. Okay, okay, okay. Let's look at the notes. Okay, let's do five. That's what we need to do. The best number. Okay, um... All right, let's turn this dial to the left. Or to the right. Now we're talking. He just sees lights turn on. That's good. That's really good if lights turn on. Okay. Um, can I read the notes? Okay, we're gonna turn that dial down. Okay, the dial's already down. Nice. Alright, let's read the notes again. We're gonna go to nine. We're gonna turn the dial right. Where the heck is nine? Who the heck is nine? Nine, 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 nine. Who the hell is nine? All right, let's. I think it's that switch that's outside. Okay, let's see if nine is out here. Oh, here's nine.
let's go. Finally. Holy shit! We're golden! Let's go. Yeah, we are. Golden. Man, feels good. Let's fucking enjoy this. Mom, let's see if she'll move. Okay, let's see if the train works. It's all yours. Damn it! Of course, we're still attached. Can you go find out where we're stuck and get us unstuck? Yeah. Okay, now I gotta go figure out how to get us unstuck. Let's change our tools real quick. Because I'm not sure if that one will work. I'm gonna try this one. This better work. Because I've been re like recording for an hour and a half now because I've been just so lost on things. I had to keep cutting stuff. Just roaming around, figuring stuff out. Oh my goodness. This better work. If it don't work, I don't know what to just, I don't know what to do. Oh my gosh, it works. There. Hey, Kenny, we're loose. Finally. Let's go. Let's go talk to Kenny. You touch any of my stuff? Oh my gosh, who the hell is this guy? Who are you? The guy who owns that stuff. I guess it's no worse for wear. Name's Chuck. Charles, if you fancy. Lee. Is that your crew outside? Yeah. And the guy up in the cab. Him too. I saw you walking through here and thought about scaring the pants off you. What? But I couldn't force myself to do it. You're still kind of freaking me out. Train folk will do that. Already met everyone outside. They all warm to me right quick in direct sunlight. So who the heck is he? You met Chuck. Yeah, I did. What the hell? It's so nice to meet someone normal for a change. He gave us candy, Ben too. He gave them candy? You have candy. Boy, I got the last piece I got on me. Figures. He's just going over here giving you women and kidding? kids candy. Sure did. Man shares my love of the road. That's for certain. <coughs> I'm awful sorry your son's not feeling good. I appreciate your concern. Well, with a little TLC, I'm sure he'll be fit as a fiddle in no time. And I can offer y'all whatever I got, although it ain't much. Thank you. We'd like to do the same. Why don't we hold off on... Uh... Stay with us. We'd like the company. Does he know how to play the guitar? Hey, Chuck. Howdy. Why are you alone? Why not? Seem to be doing all right. Fine, then. I'm sorry. I do like being around y'all, actually. It's nice. You caught us on a bad day. Mm. You still got a couple of kids. And this one's got a good spirit. That's some kind of something. I'll talk to you later. Hope so. 
This guy is so random. Hold on, I'm gonna give uh, hot uh, Katcha some animal hey, crackers. I found this. If Duck's up for it. Thank you. That's very thoughtful. He isn't fussy, you know. What? Most kids, they're really fussy about what they'll eat. Hate vegetables, that kind of thing. Not Duck, huh? No. The most trouble I ever have is making him use a fork. Thank you, Lee. Sure. Okay, as long as he eats and drinks, so that's it. He should We're be fine. Loose. Seems that way, yeah. Great. We don't got much left, so just gather whatever you have. Let's go. Want a ride? Well, it sounds like you're taking my home. That's a yes, then. And find anything better for keeping the creepy crawlies out than that boxcar. Duck's sick. Get on the train, Clementine. He's getting sicker. Let me look at him. We can keep going if you want. Damn right I won't. That's what we're doing. I think Lee just wants to talk it through. It's talked through! Get on, cat. I'll be up front. I don't want to hear any nonsense until we get where we're going. Okay, let's start going. Oh my goodness, look at Duck. He looks so sick. Be hard on you, eh? Three adults taking care of three kids. No disrespect, son. We'll be fine. We've gone through just as much as anybody else. This one's gonna grow up quick. I already am. I don't doubt it, son. Lee! Lee, I need you right now. I need you to go get Ken. What's up? Would you get that off his face? My hands are full here. Clean up, Doc. Office space, please. Oh no! He's He's coughing out, out blood. We need to stop this train. Okay. Please. Okay, let's uh, get this train stopped. Forever. Damn, can I run? I don't think Kenny's gonna want to stop the train. Stop the train. We're stopping this train. Get your hands off me! I'm, I'm sorry. I just want to talk. We gotta stop this train because Cat needs you, Kenny. Duck doesn't have much time left. He'll be fine. Katja needs you, Kenny. Duck will be fine. He won't be. He's going, Kenny. What is the goddamn deal? He's a little sick, but we can't just quit. It's a scratch. He's not like the others. Jesus, all y'all are just making it worse. Stop the train. 
Stop it, goddammit! Fuck you, Lee. You're gonna listen, or what? Calm down and... How the fuck do you calm down after a day like today? By talking to your friend. Okay. We were about a fight right there, I just know it. How many sons are you gonna let die? Shut your mouth! Oh my gosh, I did not mean to say that. Just leave me the fuck alone! I don't need you, and Doc doesn't need you! You better stop this damn fucking train right fucking now. I told Kaja I'd get you to stop this, and you bet your ass I'm gonna. You don't even have a child! You don't know what this is like, you fucker! You're not helping my family! You're not helping Clementine! You're not helping anybody! I've had your back. Don't make me fucking regret it. You want to hurt people because you're afraid. Losing duck ain't enough for you. Because you're fucking lose everything acting like this. I'll fucking kill you before I let that happen. It's... I think it's time. The boy's been bit, in case you haven't figured that out. Take as long as you need. There ain't no time left to take. What are we gonna do? We can't allow him to become one of those things. But what if... what if he doesn't? Kenny, I love you very much. I love our son more than life itself. I need you to hear me. What you are saying, that he may not turn, is foolish. But... No. There's... Come on, Cap. If you think of one, you let me know. Isn't there some sort of pill or something we can just give him? Stop it. We can just drift off to sleep. Right, hon? I mean, Jesus, this is our son. I know. But we know it's here or nothing. Oh, fuck. Just who, then? You want me to? You don't have to. I'll do it. I'll do it. No, it should be a parent. No parent should have to do something like this. He's right, Cat. We can say our goodbyes and... Just let that be it. I don't know. Lee, you'd be doing this family a great service. Why don't we take him into the forest so Clementine doesn't have to see? Oh no. Yeah. I really don't want to shoot him. Say goodbye. Of course. I feel like he's gonna turn. What's happening? I'm gonna take care of Doc. I thought he was going to die.
I'm putting him out of his misery. Oh. Yeah. Look, Clem. Things are... What the... No! What the hell? Ben, take Clementine into the train. Go. It'll be fine. What the heck happened? How did she die? Cat! Cat! Gotcha! Why? Cat! Oh no! Why? Oh fucking god! <laughs> what the hell happened? What did you- She could- She- 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 Fuck! Oh, oh, oh fuck! Dad, you gotta do this. Just put an end to it, man. It'll be okay. It'll be a I feel so bad. I am honestly feeling emotion right now because I don't, I, I've made like so many bad choices through this video. I feel so bad for Kenny. Honestly, guys, I should have shot Duck myself and I should have not let Kenny do that i thought it would be more reasonable if kenny did it because he is the father i'm gonna end off the video right here if you guys want to see the next one stay tuned for that i'll be posting it soon with a part nine see you guys